Let's talk. Does Rogue hate Canada? The entire country of Canada, does Rogue hate Canada? Let's talk about it. Hey guys, this is Coop from Garage Gym Reviews, and today I wanna to talk about something a little bit different than normal. Typically we do reviews and all the in-depth information, so if you like that thing, you wanna learn more about building your home gym, make sure you subscribe. However, today I wanna to talk about Rogue Fitness and their absolute hatred for Canada, the entire country. Okay, so let me set up the situation real quick. A couple days ago, Rogue on all their social profiles announced that they made a mistake. Well, not so much they made a mistake, but their suppliers made a mistake. And here was the mistake. 3%, this is what they've said, 3% of their steel that has been supplied from their suppliers, which by the way, the amount of steel that's probably supplied to Rogue has to be just absolutely insane but 3% came back as being from Canada. So steel that was sourced from Canada. Here's the issue, on every single Rogue Rack page or every page in which the product is made in USA, it says made in USA. On every other page, it tells you the origin of country. Most other companies don't do that. It's something I think is really cool. One, because I'm always looking at specs, I'm a spec nerd, so I'm trying to figure things out. The other one is like, you wanna know where it's coming from. So Rogue, they list on the page, made in USA. Here's the issue, 3% of that steel that's being made for the racks wasn't made in the USA, it was made in Canada. So they came out and said, we're sorry, like, we're sorry some of this steel was made in Canada. We found it out because somebody had sent us a photo of the inside of the rack, and inside of the rack, inside of the keyhole, it said made in Canada, it was stamped in there. That's how they figured it out. So they're trying to fix the issue by saying, hey, if the inside of your rack says made in Canada, then we will replace the part because Rogue Fitness hates Canada. No, that's not true at all. This is the reason they're doing this. And I can't like, I'm looking at the comments on some of this stuff and people are like blowing my mind. The reason that Rogue Fitness is replacing the can Canadian made steel or offering it to be replaced is not because Canadian steel is inferior to US steel. It has nothing to do with that. I would guess that in the future, Rogue will probably build factories in different places as they expand across the globe. So they've got a European division, but I still think they import most of the stuff from the US. They sell in Canada, but the stuff is still made in the US. I would guess eventually Rogue is gonna make factories in all those different places. So Rogue is not stating that Canadian made steel is inferior. What Rogue is stating is that a mistake was made on all of the pages in which you buy product, it tells you where it's from. If we sold you a product that said it was made in the USA, yet it was made somewhere else, regardless of where it was made, then Rogue had made a mistake. Then there was something, basically, I wouldn't say it was like they were lying because they didn't know, but the customer got something different when what they purchased. So to correct that mistake, Rogue is doing it in front of their customers and saying, hey, this mistake was made, even though it was somewhat out of our control, so we're going to correct it. This is how you build brand loyalty. This is how you build a brand that people really want to get behind because here's the fact of the matter, it being made in Canada or made in the USA, it's going to be functionally the same. The steel that's made in Canada has the same standards that pretty much as what's in the US, so you're gonna get pretty much the same product. The difference is Rogue is coming out and saying, hey, we wanna make sure that our customers know that when you order from us, you get what you ordered. And to me, that's sick, that's awesome. And like, I've liked Rogue for a long time, it's very clear. I'm not saying that they're better than any of the other companies, but I will say in this instance, this shows the heart of the company. This shows integrity because it's not about the circumstances that come towards you. You can't control the difficulties that happen in life, but you can control the way you react to them. And that's exactly what Rogue has done in this instance. They can't control the fact that somebody one of their suppliers, I don't know if they lied about it or I don't know if they just didn't know, but they supplied Maine Canada steel, but Rogue can decide how they acted out of it. And they've basically done something that I think is very admirable in saying, hey, this mistake was made, even if it wasn't on our part, even if it doesn't make for a worse circumstance, we still wanna fix it. And that's awesome.
Okay, this is Coop from Garage Gym Reviews. What do you think about the situation? Do you think like, does it make you mad that Rogue has replaced some of these things? I mean, we just have to understand like, Rogue's just trying to fix an issue. I, Rogue, I'm sure loves Canada. They sell lots of products there. This has nothing to do with a disdain for any other country. Just making sure that you get what you order. We'll see you next time. Peace.